Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another episode of my Terraria playthrough. Yes, playthrough. On the last episode, it was a mess. I said guided walkthrough. It, this, this series is my Terraria playthrough. Yes, yes, okay, I got that right. Now, the next, next thing that I need to get right is me beating the shit out of, uh, Queen Bee down here. Some of you guys were giving me shit, um... Probably, uh, because I couldn't kill this guy the second time. And, um, since I had to get a thumbnail, I went back down there, and I made one of those, uh, what are those spines called? You need 15 vertebrae, you know what? Oh, that's right. Oh, no, I can make one. What are they called? Uh, where is it? Is it not here? Isn't it 15? 20? I don't fucking know. What is this game? I've never even played this game before. Okay. Um, but off screen, I went back to the jungle, and I mainly explored this section down here. I went all the way down here. I found another uh, jungle shrine, and then there was a life crystal right here. And uh, this jungle shrine actually had a quick boomstick, as you can see, 10% faster speed. So I'm going to be using that one. And, uh, I'm gonna sell the other one to, uh, good old merchant. Two gold, that is a pretty good deal. Uh, now last episode, in the comments, I believe one person said to make, or to purchase the... What is it? The, uh, mini shark. Which I could buy right now. For 35 gold, yes, gold. Um... I'm mean, thinking about it now. I think I am. I was thinking, I'm like, eh, I could, I could probably manage. So I wanted to get a little bit more usage out of the boomstick. <sighs> Do I really need this? I'm trying to think if I really need that. Um, what I do want to make is a death bridger. De bridger. You see that, guys? Death Bridger? Death Bringer. <sighs> yep, yep. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Alright, um, I don't, I'm not gonna make a Blood Bircher. As of now, obviously, I still have a pretty good amount of Crimtain Bar, so I could do that in the future. Um, I'm not gonna make it now. Because hopefully I'll get the Beekeeper. I also got another gravitational potion, which is nice. I'm just gonna put some of this stuff away here that I don't need. Mm-hmm. Okay, I'm gonna... Do I want to risk it? I feel like I might need the mini shark later on. Of course. That's not that bad, though. It's still pretty fast. Okay, I'm selling this gold bow because I'm honestly never going to use it again. That is junk. Let's spend another gold on ammunition. And I don't know if I mentioned this or not, but a meteor did land. I, I don't know where it is exactly. So if we wanted to make those meteor shot bullets, that might be a little bit better. But I don't think I'm going to need those. Tin brick. Oh, yeah, I guess that's from the shrine. Got nine stingers. I bet. Do I have... I do. Can I make that? Yes, I can. I can make the Ivy Whip Grappling Hook. Alright, why not? Most likely better than this thing. Yep. Yes, it is. That thing can go right in the garbage. Alright, cool. That is nice. That is nice. I will say that the uh, boomstick was doing some uh, some work on those enemies down in the jungle. You know what? Might as well just buy this stupid or make this thing right now. I'm gonna need it eventually. Annoying, sweet, unpleasant. There we go. Okay. Ooh, 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 ooh. There we go. Um. Honestly, the only reason why I did that is because I don't need these bars for anything else. 
Oh, that's right. I could have made this without the tissue samples. Can I make a pick without the tissue sample? I don't think so. No. Okay. Just wanted to make sure. All right. Well, I think I'm pretty much good to go here. Ooh. Yep. Um, I'm not. Looks like I'm bringing some of these shitty potions. Hopefully, let me see here. I need to come down here and get some more of these glowing mushrooms so I can make some better potions. Uh, gravitational potion, which I just got right before the episode started. And uh, I think I'm actually going to be using that right now. Who knows, maybe I could actually find a Star Fury. That would be pretty cool to get. So, let's go ahead and use this baby right now. Give me some of them torchies, so I can't see sheet. Alright. And we are heading all the way up here. To see if I can find a few more of these floating islands. I'm pretty much just going to cut this out. So hopefully, when I find one... You know, I'm going to fast forward this section until I find one. So I'll see you guys, hopefully, once I have found a floating island. Alright guys, I was not expecting that to take that long. <laughs> that took a pretty long time to find one. Uh, I wanna hurry this up. Oh, Star Fury. Good sheet, good sheet. How much damage does this do? This is 25. I would rather use this. Alright, we're continuing on here. We are continuing on. Um, I don't know how far over- Ooh, there's another one right here. This is probably the last one if I had to take a guess. Pointy, sweet. Oh, here they come. Yeah, fuck them up. Alright. <laughs> Pretty much just went over there, got it, and left. Alright, so we got like 15 seconds left to see if I could possibly find another one. That is nice. Pointy is convenient. Alright, so it looks like we are at the edge of the world at this point. Which means there are, f what, five, four? I believe there are four of these Sky Islands. There is a shit ton of these <laughs> altars over here. Holy hell. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine. Hmm, those are the ones I'm breaking first, that's for sure. Okay. So, I would say that was a pretty, uh... Pretty good trip. Selling that. Alright guys, I think I'm pretty much ready to go ahead and fight Queen B. I think I have everything that I need. And I think I'm ready to get started. Let me get some of these so I can make some platforms. Alright guys, I'm going to go ahead and make my way over to the... Beehive, and then we are going to fight Queen Bee. I'm going to spank that bitch's booty, and uh, we're going to get on to doing something else. So I'll see you guys once I've gotten over there. All right, guys, here I am. I'm back in the underground jungle. Now, this time, I won't make the mistake of breaking the that little plaque before I am ready. Um, I actually... As soon as I broke it with the grappling hook, I remembered, I'm like, shit. I completely forgot. There's a chance of you uh, managing to break it with your grappling hook. And I completely, completely forgot about that. But I think this time around I'm ready to go here. I wouldn't really consider this to be that difficult. Alright, so there's one little plaque right there. It's gonna be a nice pick, though, that's for sure. Alright, so let's go ahead and just break all these here. Alright. Ooh. Okay. Just wanna light it up a little bit here. 
There are a shit ton of those guys. All right. So what I want to do... I think that is a nice amount to start with. Put the campfire right there. Of course, I have regen with this armor. Greatly increases life regen. That is nice. Oh, looks like I'm gonna have to use this gun. Yep, this thing is a little bit slower, I'm able to notice. But at least I was able to get powerful, that's... That's a decent trade-off right there. Come on. Yeah, this honey is such a pain in the ass. Come on. This guy's taunting me. You're done, bitch. Okay. Go ahead and add a few more of these. And my strategy. Leave the crimson rod. Something like that. And uh, just start blasting this guy. Alright. I think I'm ready to go here. Let's go, bitch boy. Give me that screenshot. Alright, I think I got something there. You see that, guys? Much easier. Do I have a chance of not using ammo with this? Yes, 33% chance. Something like that. Okay. Good sheather. Oh. Eh, might as well use the uh, Iron Skin Potion get me up to 32 defense. Why not? Alright. We're just gonna keep working here. Already down about a thousand health. Go ahead and replace the crimson rod. Alright. Some nice music, though, I will say that. Yeah, how you like it, Queen Bee? Hmm? Alright, it's about 1700 health, so about halfway. A little bit over halfway now. And we are doing work. Yep. I feel like before, if I had gotten the platform ready, I would have had a better chance. Plus, I have a lot more defense now. What was I using before? Tungsten? I think it was. So. Doing better here. Good stuff, good stuff. Um, I really don't know if there's much of a point for me to even look for the meteor. So I don't really need any of the uh, meteorite. Maybe for bullets, but other than that, you're done. And you drop the B gun. Oh yeah, fuck him up. Ooh ooh ooh. All right, got some B nades as well. That's pretty good. We also got some B wax right there. Um. All right. Well, that was uh. Pretty easy. Is there anything else really to explore down here? The temple's like right there. Hmm. Hmm. Nah, I don't want to. I was thinking about fighting Skeletron today, but I don't want to do that much in an episode. I don't know, I always feel like that was a nice, nice little fight right there. Nothing too difficult. I just thought uh, last episode it would have been maybe a little bit easier if I had defeated Queen Bee first and then I went on to Brain of Cthulhu, but I was wrong. But that really isn't an issue since um, even though I was only able to defeat the Brain of Cthulhu once, the second time around I was actually able to get a, a nice amount of the Crimtain Ore and the, uh, the tissue sample, so... Yeah. But apparently that worked out better to do uh, the Brain of Cthulhu fight for me first. Now let me head back here. Wow, I got 10 gold from that? That's nice. That's real nice. Alright. Let's go ahead and take a look here. I can make this B armor. 
I'm really, really, really thinking about doing this, but I don't know. Hmm. Is that 10? So fucking small. Uh, 22. Hmm. I, I don't think I want to do it in this series. Um. I think I might do for this episode. It might be a bit shorter. Than I would like it. I don't need that. I'm going to sell that. Uh, anything else? Doesn't look like it. Uh, let's take a look here. Can I make... You see here. Okay, apparently there's only, uh... I guess I could use the, uh... I could use the... The meteor... For... Trying to find... Oh, yeah, yeah, I could use the meteor to make a ham axe. I think that'd be pretty cool. So, I'm going to go ahead and try looking for this meteor. And, uh, I'll be back with you guys in a little bit. Alright, guys. Well, the, uh, meteor wasn't on the right side. So, uh, let's go ahead and see how our good old friend, the Dungeon Guardian's doing. Haven't seen this guy in a while. Hello, ho. I'm home. Anybody home? <laughs> oh, I'm just waiting for it. Oh, there he is! I haven't seen that guy in ages, holy hell. Spider-Man was decapitated by Dungeon Guardian. I got a dungeon key, that's pretty cool. <laughs> Alright. So, <laughs> thought that would be uh pretty fun to see that guy. I haven't seen... Freaking Dungeon Guardian ages. Alright. I'm going to, uh... Head over to the left side. And hopefully I'll be able to find out where this meteor is. So... Let's go ahead. And try to find it right now. Thank you. Alright, guys. Here we are. Found the good old... Meteor. Damn. 57 damage. Nice. So I don't really know how much I need to collect here. And I don't have any bombs either, so... I'm going to, uh... Collect a decent amount here. I don't think it's going to be that much. Maybe 20 bars. If that. That's going to be my guess. Get this guy. Okay. And continue collecting this. Oh, I'm taking damage. I didn't even notice. All right, how much we got here? Ooh. In total, that brings us up to 28. Go ahead and keep whacking these guys. I wish the guy actually lived at my house instead of living underground like a fucking hermit. Where is he? There he is. <laughs> living under there. Okay. Back to work I go. Okay, oh, alright. For a second, I thought the preset on... Or the prefix on this pickaxe was lazy, but it's large. Not bad. Alright, that is another... Okay, we're up to 47 now. Ooh. Fuck you guys. And I will, I will say that there's a pretty large amount... Oh, man. There's a pretty large... Amount of crimson biomes in this world. I want to check with the, uh... Is this the dryad? No, I think it might be the guide, actually, that tells you. I don't fucking know. No idea. One or the other. Alright. Okay, let me just finish this row right here. As far as I can go. Alright. Thank you. Brings me up to 71. And... 
Oh, yeah. For sure. Where's it at? Does it exist? You need more than 23? Alright, screw it. I'm not making it this episode. <laughs> Alright, guys. I think that is going to do it for today. As a matter of fact, probably soon I can make the Mega Shark. Do you... Make a shark, make a shark, make a shark. Nah, I don't think... Nah, I can't make that until hard mode, because I think I need... I need the illegal gun parts, I need, like, a few shark fins, and then I need, I believe, some of the, uh, souls. Souls of Fright. What is it? Fright, Might, and Sight. And that's what, no, you need, a, you need those to make the, uh, the pickaxe axe, so. Got a little bit of time until I'm able to do that, but that is going to do it for now. So thank you guys for watching this episode. As a matter of fact, why throw that out when I could sell it? I don't know if it's worth much. Eh, 40 silver, not bad. Brings me up to 27 gold coins. Not much to complain about there. Alright. Thank you guys for watching this episode. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode. And I will see you guys next time.